Good morning. It's, it's still morning. It's Good. almost afternoon. We have been, well, I, I didn't really sleep in. We did a little bit of work this morning and stuff like in. that. It's been a busy work day. But we are just in time to hop off this ship mm -hmm. at Coco Key. Yes. Key and get a chicken sandwich. And snorkel. All that stuff. And salad. Yeah. And fun stuff like that. That's we're true. here till 4 30, so we still got like six hours. Yeah, true. So we're gonna jump out. Um, we had like some fruit and some cookies for breakfast, so we really enjoyed those key snacks. And then we're gonna go get some Isla food. Yippee yes. yippee. So I guess I'm good. Let's get our cocoa key. I don't know why I'm so speaking so high. I get real squeaky when I'm excited about chicken sandwiches, but let's go eat some food uh -huh. and eat some food. Okay. <laughs> and swim. <laughs> Let's see if the forward elevators will get us there. Yeah, there's only forwards and afts on this ship, so Someone I think they both. There. Oh, true. We could be smart and read stuff. Monday. Gangway button. Okay, so apparently it is three. Why are we going to 12 also? Oh. Anyway, we're not. <laughs> Why does your side say 12 and my side doesn't say 12? Anyway. Half is going to 12. All right, well, I'm going to the gangway. Can I put the gangway? Yes. Uh-oh. So you need to go up to deck five all the way to the... To the place. back. Oh, there's two small wonders. All right, well, we may have to look at those later. We got stuff to do. Chicken sandwiches to eat. All right, promenade. We'll get off the ship eventually. <laughs> oh, here, look at... Oh, is that a small wonder? I don't know what that is. Anyway, let's go. Oh, gosh, this elevator just decided it was going to go up after it said it was going down. Help, we're never getting off the ship. Oh my Help. gosh! Help, we're stuck. I think we're How going to a we going? we're going to 106 apparently. What? How many decks are on this ship? I don't want to go up. Holy crap! I'm gonna go eat a Oh gosh, right. Let's, go. Let's try that. There we go. Any sense? Thank you, deck three. Quick announcement and FYI for you. The forward gangway right now is. <laughs> Closed. Thanks, Mike. <laughs> oh, we do get the cool escalator. All on board is 430. Oh my gosh, this Coco Key is so gorgeous. It's beautiful. We're the only ship here, which is nice. Guys, getting to Coco Key is hard. It's difficult. Hashtag first world problems. I mean, oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, let's go have some fun. The balloon is flying. The water slides are towering. Yes. We are gonna start our adventure here at the tram station and I think head over toward Breezy Bay. That's us. Hello, Snack Shack. Dee has gone with her salad. What is it called? Grilled vegetable vegetables salad? vegetables and you add chicken to it. Nice. Mozzarella sticks and mozzarella sticks and a chicken sandwich, which will soon have these mozzarella sticks on it. <laughs> yes. Now, I know I'm normally a purist and I get the version of the chicken sandwich without the lettuce, tomato, and all that stuff on it, but it's actually pretty good if you do it on the full-on shack version as well. A little messy because there's mayonnaise on there. So either way, just do it. You're good. In other news, D is hungry for vegetables. Wow. <laughs> we had a weird breakfast, so. That's true. Yeah, I'm hungry. <laughs> We're wandering over now toward Chill Beach, Chill Island, Chill Chill something. <laughs> Looking for a towel hut, actually. Well, that's weird. Looks like there might be two towel huts on the entire island denoted by this little symbol that looks like squiggly, foldy towel things. It's so funny. In walking from the snack shack over to where we are now, we accidentally walked by it, but I think it might be tucked in some, some greenery. So let's go find it. It's by the pool. There it is between Chill Grill and the Oasis Lagoon Pool. Yeah. Now we've come back over. They got little lockers and stuff. There's some cabanas and whatnot over here at the edge of Chill Island. Little bar. Now we haven't really wandered this section. Old jet ski dock. Cabana concierge. So we're over here checking out the cabanas today. This is just an empty cabana I'm gonna take a peek at. But we got some friends, Richie and Olivia, have invited us to check out their cabana. But here's what an empty one looks like. Let's step up in here and find out. Nice couch. Little table, actually the table has a safe built into it, which is kind of interesting. Well, that was just the cabinet side. Here's the safe side. Oh yeah, because I can't open it, but little combination safe. 
stools, little plastic chairs, loungers, floats. This unit is actually like a cooler. Oh yeah, they got like little bottles of water in there and stuff. Oh, the cabana even comes with some floats and stuff too. But apparently this is uh, their cabana back, that I'm back in now. They'll bring you like anything and everything you want. They got the old chicken sandwiches and mozzarella sticks delivered and some salads. This is a whole tray of pineapple. There's like watermelon and cantaloupe and bottles of water and they filled this sucker up with ice. So super cool. <coughs> Dee is already out there snarkling. The seagulls are up here, you know, seagulling. But yeah, look at these. This is right over here on the edge of kind of where Breezy Bay meets Chill Island. A little refreshing out here. Oh yeah, there's the refreshment level. Oh, I already see a trumpet fish right on the surface of the water. I don't know if you'll be able to see that, but I'm sure Dee is capturing all the uh, footage. Folks have seen stingrays, like southern stingrays, and at least one manta ray out here today. I don't know if the manta is still hanging around, but I know Richie had some footage of it, and it was kind of awesome. That is quite the sizable trumpet fish. Okay, he doesn't, maybe he doesn't speak my language of trumpet. Oh, the water's creeping higher. I should probably shuffle feet while I'm out here, huh? Oh, man. Balloon action. Look at all this chill island, chill beach. Hey, baby. What's up, buddy? Hi, guys. What's up? This is cool. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, it's awesome. It's the best cold air ever. Hello. Hello. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi it is warmer than last week when we were at Castaway. Still definitely refreshing. Everybody's like, what's the water like in the Bahamas in February? It's cold. Um, I don't know the exact temperature, but I'm pretty sure it's cold degrees. But yeah, I'm very refreshed. It was a nice little warm walk over here and nice and sunny. The air temperature is super nice. Nice. How many times can I say nice? It's nice. Is there a decent sneak behind me? Wait a minute now. I'll kick, kick, splish, splash is off to find some more fish fish. I am already up to um, like my shoulder, so it gets nice and deep over here. I don't guess this section of the beach is really reserved for, you know, like the folks who did the cabanas, because I feel like you could walk down here and just, you know, get in the water real fast and pew. Um, but it's looking pretty nice over here. Oh, I see a dark shape in the water. Yeah, I think it's the massive mammoth biggie. <gasps> Granddaddy biggie. Gosh, he is a big dark shadow. Let's chase him toward D and let her look at him. All right, I see him like right over in that direction. Can, I think she sees him. There's two. Well, Biggie is getting up close and personal. Yeah, Sergeant Majors are here, the juvenile Palamettas. Nice clear shots of Biggie. Think, oh, and then there's like Biggie Jr. That's the one with the little spot on his side. This is air snorkeling. It's amazing. We got a barracuda over here. So Dee's coming to check him out. I think Richie's got eyes on the... Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. She's found Barry over here again. We're gonna make our way down to these shallow parts. Barry's big. Did you say? Did you say he had big fat teeth a minute ago? No, I said he has big teeth. Well, big teeth. Okay. I don't know how to have. Well, this little seagull has been fussing at this other seagull for the, like, I don't know, 20 minutes this little thing's been yelling at this other seagull. I don't know, and the other seagull's just like, I don't care, I don't know what the seagull did. He's having a fit. I think we're gonna jump out for a minute and maybe drink some water. 
they eat some fruit. There's a ton of fruit up here. <laughs> oh man, we came up to find out. Richie and Olivia ordered us some cookies and some brownies. It. I know I'm trying, not letting my shirt drip on these things. Mmm, <laughs> snack shot goodness. So here on the table, you actually have a call button to where you can like request that they come check you out. They've given you a cabana guide to Coco Key. That's kind of cool. The uh, drink menu seems to be the same one you would find around at the pool bars and stuff around the island. But there's a cabana food menu. It's kind of like, you know, snack shacky stuff. Oh, okay. That's awesome though. All right, we're getting wrapped up. We're getting ready to head back to the ship. We just made some fancy dinner reservations we for did. tonight. We did. We'll talk about that later. But anyway, thanks again, you guys, for inviting us to the cabana. No problem, anytime. Yes. Did you enjoy? It's nice. And the snorkeling in this area is cool because it's like not so wavy and there's really good stuff to see. Apparently, you can see eagle rays. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you got some good footage yeah. of that. Yeah, I can send it to you. Guys. All right, I might. <laughs> send it to you on All right. If I, if I get the footage, yep. I editing Jay is going to put it in right now. So if, if you didn't see anything, then apparently I didn't get the footage. But I'm just gonna see it. Anyway, all right, but we're gonna head back to the ship. Thanks again, y'all. Thank you. Fun hanging yeah, out, but you. this is awesome. <laughs> now we're gonna hoof it back to the ship. There's a little straw market. But anyway, get our steps in today. Get our steps in. Officially sailing away from Coco Key. Bye, pretty island with your fancy balloons and water slides and chicken sandwiches. We'll miss you. Chicken sandwich, that's fine. Yeah. No. <laughs> uh, we are getting ready to go to dinner. So mm -hmm. Coco Key has sailed off into the distance it was and a nice day. we have booked ourselves an early specialty restaurant because well we were just sitting on the island and we're like, what do we want to do for dinner tonight? Dining room, eh, eh. let's just sit there because the Wi-Fi extends to the island. Right, which is nice. And the low cabana had a Wi-Fi extender in it, <laughs> which was nice. And so Dee just popped on there and booked us some Izumi. Yes, I want a poke bowl really bad. Yeah. Tonight is not my favorite menu overall oh, MDR. on Royal Caribbean. We've had it a lot, so let's go have some sushi. Yeah, might yeah. as well. So we're doing not the hibachi side. because <laughs> no. Is that even open? I yeah. don't know, but we're it doing is. the sushi side. Mm -hmm. So we've done it before. We'll do it again. It's delicious. Looking forward to it. Yeah. <laughs> um, and that's all I know. We've got like the aqua show yeah, later. Hopefully. <laughs> cool stuff should be happening. So more day to come. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Henry. Well, I forgot to mention we had uh, some assistance at the cabana from Nathan, who was awesome, super attentive. You push that call button, he was like, pa, 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 bring you whatever you want. We took a picture with him, so editing me, throw that in there now. But he was super amazing. So thank you again for an amazing day. Now to dinner. Here on deck four aft, we have Izumi. Oh, yeah, that creepy glowing guy. Oh, there we go, right by the window. So I think we are going to do the pre-fix option, which is the $34.99. You get one small plate and a choice of two large plates. I guess that also includes dessert. Yeah, it does. Uh, he said right now they are out of the pork gyoza dumplings and the shrimp firecracker spring roll, but everything else appears to be fair game. We also got their specialty cocktails, sakes, and beers. He said they are currently out of the Asahi and the Sapporo, but they have the rest of the beers. There's tea and wine and, you know, wine and wine. He brought the little plate by with the warm towels on it. And again, we awkwardly questioned ourselves, do we pick these up and wash our hands with them? Do we supposed to scrub our faces with them? But we just, we gave a delicate diggle wiggle wiggle to the hands. I think that was appropriate. We're so civilized. So they brought us some edamame to start, and we we're doing some diamond drinks in here. So Dee got one called She's a Geisha. <laughs> it's really good. Uh, I got a spicy Okinawa. Sounded, you know, delicious and something like me. 
Ooh, that spicy Okinawa is actually a little spicy. It took me by surprise. It's good though. It's kind of vinegary a little bit. I'm not, I don't drink sake much. I'm not used to the flavor yet. So to me, it reads as kind of a little vinegary, tangy, and spicy. I gotta, let, yeah, I gotta let D get in on this little spicy action and tell me I'm not crazy. Even the hibachi people are applauding the fact that you're trying it. Oh, apparently, um, yeah. It's got some tang to it, I'll tell you. Tang, girl. It does. She pushed that right back over to my side. Okay, there we go. I will not be promoting that. We've already chowing into our appetizers. You've got a shrimp wonton soup. I got the, I think it was called chicken karage. I've already eaten a couple of pieces of it. Fried thigh meat of chicken that came with a nice little spicy sauce. And I went ahead and completed the trifecta of cocktails with the Japanese strawberry. D has gone with a poke bowl. It's the best ever. You love that. Thing. It's so good. It's a lot of food too. Yeah. Got a couple of sushi rolls. I kind of forgot what the names were, so maybe Editing J can plop those down at the bottom. And my food, it's not here yet. <laughs> there we go. Mine is the beef teriyaki bowl with rice and beef and vegetables. For dessert, D has gone with the mochi ice cream again. It's like gummy covered ice cream balls or something. And I got the sesame balls with the paste inside. The paste inside? Yes, sesame paste. The good smell. The red bean paste, you know what I mean, whatever's in there. We're wandering forward on deck four now through the art gallery. That was a stinking delicious dinner. That was really good. Good gracious. That salmon roll, the best. That was really good. Ever had oh. Ooh, Open sesame. Oh, there's the snacks today. We don't need a bit of it. Cheese, desserts, cold cuts, chicken wings. Ah. Oh. D is using the fancy coffee machine. Yes. What is this, cafe latte? Sure. <laughs> Y'all, we are fancy. I have gone with a latte macchiato. Ooh, that's a lot of um milkiato in there. <laughs> There's some coffee action. We are learning slowly but surely about this fancy diamond life. Looks like we made it. Is the coffee good? Yeah. If you guys come on a cruise and you want a fancy coffee. We can't let you in the diamond club. <laughs> She's not. She's not in here. Stop it now. We are in the cool kids club. We're one of the cool kids now. We had to tell the guy. We had no idea how to use the machine. Yeah, we're cool. not that cool. <laughs> well, we've got some more coffees to go and we're going to have a wander. We're going to have a stroll through the park in the dark. Yes, and possibly find a rogue owl. Well, at least we'll have some pretty ship scenery if we don't, you know, even if we don't see an owl. Elton John singing on the speakers. No owl sightings as of yet. It looks like they have either had or will be having some guitar music out here, which is always pleasant. in the park. Oh, starfish. In addition to looking for an owl, I'm also looking for rubber ducks out here. People love to hide them in the park. Oh, Central Park Library. Yeah, it seems to kind of be like I'm um, empty, but maybe you used to be able to go in there and read. Oh, wow, there's a speaker right over here where we can hear the guitar man's playing too. He's coming out of these bushes. Butterflies are singing to me. <laughs> We've got Tiffany and Company, John Hardy, all sorts of, you know, artworks and things. Here's where they keep their selfie taken D's out here in the park. <laughs> oh gosh, here's another one. Peek in here. I think this one is called Sycamore. It's a tree. <laughs> it is. 
Hello, Boardwalk. We are ready for Aqua 80. So this is 80s music mixed with Aqua Show. What could be better than that? And the pool looks nice and still. I think we are in good shape tonight. Oh, well, they're getting somebody strapped in up there. I think he's trying to be Marty McFly from Back to the Future too. He's got kind of like that self-fitting jacket and the Nikes and all that stuff on. So, welcome to the '80s. <laughs> to the Schooner Bar area because we've still got some diamond drinks to burn. We're not going through these things very quickly. section called Meet the Collinses. So Dee got a John Collins, which is actually featured on the menu back there. And I got a Pierre Collins. Ooh la la. Pink drink. I know, I don't know why I end up with the pink drinks. It's a little red, but you know, it's, it's good. Okay, that's better. Yeah, yeah, mine. mine's better. The Pierre, it has Chambord in it. Yeah, um, it's just like more ingredients. Right. Mine's literally just Alright, give them the rundown on mine. What's oh, mine? It's Remy VSOP. Remy Martin VSOP. Uh -huh. Shipboard Black Raspberry Liqueur. Lime. Lengthened with lime. Well, whatever that means. Cranberry Juice and Club Soda. Mine's so much better. Mmm, mm, I might drink this. Hey, give mine back. <laughs> to the cabin to find a little friend. That's our first little friend to the cruise, isn't it? Mm -hmm. They don't do them every night on Royal Caribbean. Okay. Sad. They no, think it's about three. <sighs> yeah, we are party animals, okay? It is 11.20. Super is. party <laughs> We wrapped up our night in the piano bar. It was so peaceful. So how about that aqua show? Okay. 
That was really oh, amazing. You were excited with some words. No, I we've seen three now. Mm. I do think that is my favorite. Yeah. Yeah, and the music, of course, is just like one of those nostalgic things for everybody. Even it's if 80s. you weren't around in the 80s, you still know 80s music. Some of you may think. not. Um, but they did lots of synchronized swimming, which was cool. I've always been a fan of that, watching mm. it in the Olympics and to see it like in person was really awesome. Yeah. Amazing dancing. They still did the slack wire and the high dive jumps. A little bit of trampoline, but yeah, not too much. Yeah, so good. Love that show. Yeah, what I learned was the 80s rocked. <laughs> wow. Yes. Gentle. The 80s was awesome. Then we went and listened to music. We did. <laughs> Peaceful, tinkle, tinkle, tinkle music. I didn't pee that much, but that's okay. <laughs> Um, and then we got to the end of our night and we realized we could not. We, we burned up three diamond yeah, rings apiece today. We could not do a fourth one. We should have started earlier on the island or something. We feel fine. We just cannot fit in. Yeah, we're full. <laughs> and we're going to bed. But pro tip, if you mm -hmm. find that you have diamond drinks at the end of your night, you can get a canned beverage like water, which might be a waste depending on your hydration needs, or like a Truly. Mm -hmm. Oh or yeah, a, Angry Orchard. Yeah. Uh, maybe a can soda, I'm not sure. Maybe, that, and just, yeah. you know, ask them not to open it or whatever, and then come throw it in your fridge. So that's what we did. We I got some Truly's in our fridge. Yeah. So. Kind of cool. Gotta burn up those points, right? Because if you don't use them, you'll lose them. Right, and that's a waste. Not points, drinks, you know what I mean. But anyway, we're going to bed. <laughs> yes. And tomorrow's a sea day. Yeah. We're seeing a show. <laughs> but you guys don't get to see it, so anyway. Y'all come back. Oh, yeah, we can't record it. No. Y'all come back tomorrow for mm -hmm. some C-Day fun. It'll be fun. Yeah, bye.